The festival of Diwali is an auspicious time and one for reflection. This was the theme of greetings from the Senate on Friday as greetings were delivered at the end of the sitting. Rising for the government was Parliamentary Secretary Avinash Singh, who called for the symbolic lights of Diwali to be used as a beacon for sustainable development for all. As we prepare to bask in the glow of Diaz, it is a good time to make a resolution to remove all darkness and negativities in our lives. As with any developing nation, Mr. Vice President, we treat with the darkness, the reality of lawlessness, substance abuse, and social inequity. Let us then resolve to do whatever we can to let our positive lights shine to improve the lives of those our paths cross with. His opposing member from the United National Congress, Khadija Amin, told the Upper House that this country must always rejoice in the fact that we all have the freedom to openly practice our different religious and cultural rites and rituals without fear of persecution. Our nation is at present in a state of despair. But I say to the people of the nation, even though we are facing uncertain times in our nation, this Diwali, the light of the deer, is a symbol of hope. It is our fervent hope on these benches that Diwali 2019 will continue to foster a spirit of inclusiveness and promote cultural and religious tolerance and understanding among all citizens of this great Republic of Trinidad and Tobago. And representing the voice of the independent senators was Deirup Timal, who called for the nation to reflect on the true meaning of wealth. We have a responsibility to others. We have a responsibility to those in our community by the giving and the sharing of what we are fortunate to acquire in terms of wealth. And as a country, that we have a responsibility as leaders and legislators and all of us to ensure that the wealth that we acquire is distributed equitably 